This is the littlest Blue Devil. He's looking for information about the architecture on Duke's campus. He finds a book in the library's online catalog and wants to check it out. In the catalog, he finds the call number, which is like the book's address. The location icon tells him it's on the third floor of Perkins Library. Let's go with him to get it. Call numbers are displayed horizontally in the catalog, but vertically on the book spine, and it can be easier to see the parts of the call number when they're displayed vertically rather than horizontally. Let's start with the first part, the letters LD. Once the littlest blue devil is on the third floor, he uses the signs on the end of each shelf to find the J's, K's, and then, alphabetically, the L's. Now he can move on to the second part of the call number, 1732. This range of numbers is also displayed on the signs at the end of the shelves. Looks like he's found the right one. These numbers are read as numbers, so LD 1732 would come after LD 1700 and before LD 1750. Now we can move on to the next part of the call number, D 8323. This part of the call number is arranged alphabetically and then numerically, so for instance, the C's come before the D's. For the numbers, read them like decimals. D8323 comes before D84. This call number has a second letter and number combination, but not all call numbers will. Read this one the same way as the one before. The last piece of the call number is the publication year. Looks like the littlest blue devil has found the book he was looking for. To check it out, he heads down to the library service desk. Happy reading, little fella. Remember, if you ever have questions about finding a book, you can always ask a librarian for help.